Hello everyone, today I'm testing another one oil distillation machine. Uh, this one is for used automotive oil distillation or processing. Now, the customer didn't want the machine to be smell like an old uh, engine sump. So we agreed that they're gonna test it with uh, some stripped alcohol so the machine is clean absolutely clean and I'm running good alcohol so I've got stripped alcohol now here's the first portion that came out of the machine it's almost it shows almost 95% of alcohol alcohol content and I am processing not I am processing the machine is processing this particular stuff and this one is about how much it's about 50 40 percent 40 percent of alcohol content now we've got another portion coming out I'm gonna test it Slightly percentage slightly lower, a little bit lower. I will need to increase the cooling, but with this one, cooling works in slightly different way. So we can see it separates alcohol from water quite efficiently. I set it up to run at 90 degrees. The real temperature within the reactor right now it's 94. It's gonna drop down, but the machine is set uh, at 90 degrees. The thermal control is at 90 degrees. Here we've got water that constantly separated from the alcohol. So as you can see, this machine is versatile. This steel is versatile, and it can be used for processing of. Uh, crude alcohol to make some sort of fuel ethanol uh, one of the variations of this machine capable to separate accidentally mixed diesel and petrol also this type of machine would be capable to separate some solvents mixed with some other stuff like with oil or whatever and in this case I'm running running alcohol so I'm gonna increase the temperature oh sorry gonna increase the water flow so the actual cooling and I actually can increase the flow of uh, alcohol into the machine and we'll see how it's gonna affect the actual strength of the alcohol Now I increase the flow of the alcohol into the steel and we've got some increase of the percentage here at the output and um, yes I still got some alcohol over here if I decrease the I will try to decrease it again just to see how it separates but the main thing main idea is just to check the steel make sure it's not it doesn't leak anywhere, it uh, works perfectly, no hiccups at different uh, regimes of flow and supply. Uh, also the idea is to check this particular control box that now set at 90 degrees. I probably try to set it at 80 degrees and uh, at the same time we'll decrease the flow supply flow and we'll see how it's gonna affect the percentage of the alcohol over here it's just, I'm just playing I'm just playing uh, nothing gonna happen to this alcohol I'm gonna mix it all over it again you know and uh, I will be able to process it later to make some boost or whatever or test something else Anyway, main idea is to test the unit without uh, making it smell 
too bad. Okay. Now I'll try to decrease the temperature and try to just to keep the temperature within the temperature of uh, ethanol boiling and we'll see how it's gonna help us. Same procedure will be with the temperature of oil boiling, uh, but the temperature is gonna be much higher, it's about 410 degrees Celsius, not the moderate temperature like I've got right now over here. It's gonna be different. Now we've got 91, so I have to do something faster rather than slow because I'm running out of alcohol. Now I'm running it for the second time. I mean I'm running the water that I've got after the first distillation and trying to squeeze everything out of the water. Now our percentage is about 70, probably gonna increase because I increase the flow. Because it's hot, it's hot over here, so it's about 30%. And again, it's not about alcohol distillation, it's just about tasting this unit, this particular unit. And here we've got almost 70%. At the beginning, when I've got 50% over there, I've been able to get up to 90 at this end. But anyway, uh, this unit has no reflux or something like that. It's just straight distiller for the oil designed for different purposes but I just had to test it make sure it's not leaking anywhere uh, running perfectly everything's working control unit is working and this is the way to show show the customer that unit is, exists that it's running without any problems okay thank you very much Uh, this is it. I finished the distillation, switch it off, and I've got the overage, overage percentage. It was about, yeah, about 